Hello, I am Colton Johnston, and I'm a ranger from Zion National Park. A very small number of visitors do things that diminish Zion National Park's natural beauty. We want you to understand the ways they hurt the park so that you recognize and can help stop when it's happening. We also want you to understand how the National Park Service rehabilitates damaged areas so that you can enjoy them again. Rangers and volunteers in Zion have been spending hours cleaning unnecessary vandalism in the park, such as stickers, permanent markers, rock and tree carvings, and in this case, spray paint. National Park Service staff also must take time away from providing visitor services and doing research so that they can repair the damage. In the case you can see here, seven park rangers and volunteers had to work more than 35 hours sanding to remove 150 square feet of spray paint. It took time and skill to remove the paint without permanently hurting the surface of the rock. They also took great care to avoid harming slow-growing lichens and to clean up after the work was done so that wildlife would not be harmed. We hope this will not happen again, but if it does, you can help us make sure people who hurt the park are held accountable. If you see anyone applying a sticker, using markers or paint, carving, or doing anything else that could be considered harmful, find a ranger. If a ranger is not nearby, take a picture and find a National Park Service staff person or call investigative services at the number listed here to give a description of what you saw. You don't have to tell us who you are, but please tell us what you know. Vandals who commit these illegal acts may be guilty of a Class B misdemeanor, which is punishable by six months in prison, a $5,000 fine, or some combination of both. We need your help to make sure visitors can enjoy Zion today and forever. Do your part in protecting national parks for future generations by leaving no trace. Take only pictures, leave only footprints.